look at the stack here. There's two containers, some electronics, some boxes and bags, and then you have a stack here that goes down to that box right there. This all came from the 127 yard sales and we only shopped for two days. Can you imagine? Jim, what if we would have shopped all week long? We'd fill this thing up. The whole storage unit would have been filled up. But guys, the stuff had to come here because this is not going in our home. I'll take a little bit at a time and then I'll get it listed on eBay. So get ready. We're going to show you what's in these containers. Jim, come down to my level. Oh, there. Can you see him? Guys, we got these new glasses. Look how dark they are. Yeah, they're good. I know. It keeps that sun out of our screw. eyes. So what's the first thing you're going to show them that we found on the one our trip on the 127? The um, food processor. Three bucks. What brand? Elec uh, G General Electric. And, you know, if we didn't test it, so we don't know if it works, but... For three bucks. You have to take it apart. Yeah, well you gotta unlock it. This part here and this part here sells for $15. This part sells for another $15. The blade sells for $9.99. And the motor, if it does work, we could part it out and make three times our money or put it up there for 30 bucks. I think we'll probably part it out. People are looking for replacement parts on some of these vintage items. And I've got a chrome receiver hitch and I needed a trailer ball. And that's the size trailer ball I needed for two bucks. I picked it up. Oh, so that was for us. I wasn't sure when you bought that. Well, of course, I always pick up Tupperware. Um, the lid needs some cleaning. I will soak that in some Dawn dish soap and maybe some OxyClean, but you've got a relish server. And guess what? It's missing the strap. I picked some of those up oh, quite a while ago that I have the strap at home. Pick them up in Toledo, I do believe. Yeah, to go with it. So this will probably sell for $12. Not bad for a 50 cent buy. And I forget what I paid for this, but an Emerson weather radio with vintage. It goes, even got the Citizen Band radio in it. Uh, Check it out and see if it works. If it works, it'll sell for about 40 bucks. We I had think I paid about $5, I, I think, think five. So. I think five bucks. We had a similar one from an estate sale that you did very well on. Look at this, a can koozie, Winston. Cigarettes. Yes, that's cigarettes. So these are selling for 15 to $20. I'll take it home. I'll give it a good bath and it will be listed. And this here was a, great deal got it for 10 bucks and it is a Adele? Was that? I can't model, see it. model 88 from by henry Kloss, and they say sell pretty good it should sell for around 70 to 75 bucks and he has the remote. the remote i got the remote and the external antenna and it is in another container so we will get to that when we get we'll put to it, it in there so we didn't lose it right and again VCR sell good. This one's a $30 VCR for five bucks. It came with a remote. Yeah, the remote's in the box. Remote's right there. Okay, while well, he's moving his stuff, I found two Paula Deen saucepans, and they look really nice, clean inside. So I'm going to give them a scrub. They're going to get a bath, and I can lock these together. And these are probably, I've got $7 in the two pans, be listed for maybe $34 to $40. I think I saw them up, up to $39.99 for two. And I don't know how to say the Onkino. Onko receiver. Got it for $10. Onkio? Onkio. I don't know. Got it for $10. If it don't work, it's fifty-five dollars for parts because people are looking to repair them, and or one hundred forty-nine dollars 
Any idea what year it is? I never did look at it. Here, let me look out. Is. Turn it my way. I'm not quickly seeing a year, but that doesn't mean anything. I'm just not seeing it. So the table is filled again. What do you have in that box? I got never wet rust oleum brand in industrial keeps uh whatever your uh, your shoes and your shovels and everything from being wet never oh i thought it yeah see wow. see treated i didn't know what that really was hey I, I, I could put that on mine and not get muddy all i know is it's getting hot out here we came over here because it was cloudy and we thought that and we now the sun's record. out Bought the bought a whole case of it, six boxes of it, ten bucks. They're selling for nineteen ninety five a piece plus shipping. Okay, here is a Google Home Mini. <laughs> I think you paid three dollars for this. This is worth eighteen to fifteen dollars on eBay. So you know what? It's still a good profit. And I brought bought a price label maker and got the scanner too didn't know it was in the box and she'll have to put the price up her because if i can i don't know how to do it so don't so she can figure it out if, hopefully she can put it out but if not i'll put it in writing if i can figure out how to I put paid yeah five dollars for the whole box it's got the chargers it's got labels it's got batteries batteries it's got uh how much is this worth all by itself $119. Oh, I thought you told me that was different. That was almost $200. And that's something. All right, I have some Vera Bradley. I call them garment bags. And the Bradley, battery look like you brand new in they it. They call them a trifold. So it is, I call it a garment bag. This is retail. Do I have a price on it? Yeah, nope, price. they took it off. All right, retail is what showed in a... Um, eBay ad was like one fifty. Eighty dollars they got out of it. I have the Riviera. I'm gonna have to look up and find the name of this print. We have two of them. Oh, I thought, that was I thought it has tags, but it didn't. So two garment bags. Got more. This purse says Lola Java Blue with tags. It did have a price on it. Sixty-three dollars. Has the tag inside. Brand new. One more. This does not have a tag. It does not look used. Oh, it was open. It, I know you can't see it. It looks new all of these the purses let's say low end on the purses let's just say twenty dollars especially on this one that has a tag i have twenty dollars in all of this this is going to bring back every bit let's go low 170. and we did get a wee one of my hat i didn't know they made one that laid down most of them are supposed to stand that way, but this one looks like it lays down instead of stands up. I didn't know they made one. And we got that. Put a game or two with it and get 75 to $100 out of it. All right, I picked up these Tupperware glasses. They look really nice. They all have lids. So I thought that they had lids that would take a straw. They don't. So you can have something, put it in the refrigerator, and it's not going to get spilled. So Tupperware, I paid $5 for them, paid up a little bit for Tupperware, but I'm not sure what they sell for. I'll have to check that out. I didn't get that far. Also got a PlayStation 2, all the cords, and what, five games? I have no idea what you have in that box. I know I found the box, but I don't remember what all was in it. We got ATV 2 Off-Road Fury, Tony Hawk's Underground, Guitar Heroes. We're going to
gonna have to find a guitar for it. Tell it with a guitar. They got Guitar Hero, regular one, and Cabela's Big Game Hunting. Well, you know what? The, maybe the um, Guitar Heroes can be sold as two in a lot all by themselves. Right. So um, I turned my back and Jim bought PS4 games. So what do we get? We might have a PS4 at the house that needs um, checked. We have God of War. They're all in it. I'm not opening them. Sims 4. NBA 2K19. NBA K220. Star Wars Battlefront. Mortal Kombat 2. Madam 25. Madden. Everybody's Golf. Madden 19. This one does not have the cover. The cover. And it is Madden 18. So, how many was that? Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten games. Why don't you just put them in that box with that? I don't know what I'm going to do with this. It is a fun game. Run. Smart butt. We'll say that. Think fast. Talk first to win. So, it's kind of like a trivia game, sort of. But it's just, it's a fun game to play. It's brand new in the wrapper. I know my sister's good have taken this game places and leaving it and let them, let the people keep it. So if she needs another smart butt game, I will give this to her. I've never seen a long and burger bag like this. It has the lining. I'm not gonna put, yeah, maybe I can get it out of here. Anyways, it's got the liner in it. I don't know what it's worth. I haven't looked it up. One more thing. Got a Pokemon, gotta catch them all. And this is a journal book, never been used. And this will probably be kept as a gift. So that is what we have on this bunch of goods. Whose brainy idea was it to come over here today? He says it's overcast. Let's go film everything we got. Guess what? The sun come out. It's bright. And it's, it's hot. hotter than blazes. It is. So let's get through this so you can see the treasures we got. And we got parts for food processors. I don't know what that one goes to, but this one here does say sunbeam on it, and we've got cutting blades. I thought they were going to fall. I've got All right, of them. so he'll have to figure out what they go for and what we can sell those for. And what, I think he paid $2, $2 for, for all the that box. stuff. So, all right. Um, not sure if these will sell yet this year, but we've sold all of the baseball gloves. We have an Easton. A Rawlings. A Rawlings. And a Wilson. Wilson. So we have three ball gloves. And this one's a right hand, or all four left handed players. That's all right. It's hot. Then we got a Vegematic. Vintage Vegematic. You got a Vegematic? Yeah. It's got the blade, two of the three blades. And it's got the original box. And it's got the original box, and the it's got the booklet in there. No. What'd you do? I dropped it. Oh no. You break it? Probably. She dropped her clicker. Hopefully she didn't break it. Well, you put it together before. She Lots got 45 books. books from... They're what? mostly romance novels and series, um, Victorian. So, yeah. He's my hero. He fixed my clicker, but you know what? I'm going to order a couple more of these for when I drop them. She bought a whole thing of books. Over 40, right? 45 of them to be exact. I counted them for a change. Look at this nice wherever stainless one quart pot and it's you can pour from either side. Um, this is a nice heavy saucepan. I paid two dollars for it. Got a brand new pair of Skechers. And little kids, I forget this They ain't this never size. been used. 
Now this is a Pampered Chef three and a half inch cut and seal. It's a crimper. You can get real fancy with your breads or anything you want to crimp, dough, anything. That came with this. It's the wrong lid. Wrong lid. Let me see this. Take the lid. This is a fobberware. And a little barkeeper's friend will clean up the inside. Eeyore and a bunny. Who made it? That's a come from the Disney, Disney store. store. Alright, this is a couture purse. And I've sold several of these that we got in the trash bag suitcase unit. So pick this up, of course, at a garage sale, $3. Again, another juicy couture. This is a backpack. Very nice. Again, I paid three dollars for it. I'm not sure what it's going to retail for or what it's going to be listed for, but you know, it'll be and a good return. Here, let me have this back. Eight cups, bowls, saucers. This says and a bigger bowl. Genuine melamine made in the USA. Yeah. So I think this is an older melamine. So, and I've done well selling the melamine. melamine. I think I have a buying problem. No, you're selling just as fast as you're buying. I know, so but I love decent. to buy corningware. Now, look, I've got to show you this. I'm going to put the lid down. I don't want to break it. They've done all this is vintage corningware, blue radio wave, heartbeat, EKG, brown and served dish. She had these in a lot of these dishes, the corningware. Then you get this corningware. This corningware with lid. This is a glass baked dish with the lid. This is this is old. So I'm not sure what the value of this is. And another corningware. I've never seen that pattern. I've never bought an oval Pyrex platter, but when I look this up, it is selling for really good money. I think it's $25 plus. Don't hold me at that. It's just trying from my memory. Then the two Pyrex bowls, they're selling for pretty good money. And what happened at the... Um, this is... All this is where we had our flat. And they were the nicest couple we have ever met. So I don't know if they remember our channel, but thank you for your hospitality. Trying. We appreciated all of their help. Shout out to them because they was, you know, he went in his garage and brought the jack out so I could jack it up so I didn't have to use a screw jack. And Great people. Hey, I got some... Brand new HD design outdoor four pack of stainless steel insulated wine tumblers. Brand new in the box, double wall stainless steel. Oh, I can tell you what they're selling for. I've already looked it up. They're like $20 a set on uh -huh. eBay. Yeah, I. Why do you think I bought them? Because I checked them first. Yes, you got four sets of them. Yes, there's four. Ugh. Three more in here. Then she got more Tupperware. Tupperware. But here, this, that it's, is it's one. A it's a drainer. You it's a steamer. Steamer. You have, you have one and I have one. A big one and a little one. Yes. Got paper blown. And a, another lettuce keeper. Lettuce keeper. And it actually has the little um, spike. Thing. I don't know why I bought these. Not, now I know why I bought them. I remember my grandma and grandpa having these Hall oven proof coffee cups. My paper's gonna blow, but I have four of them here. And what brand is that? Reveal, Rival. Rival. Rival electric fruit, fruit slicer. Meat slicer. Meat slicer. This home meat, home and food it has this is what the motor that's the motor and then yeah. what he's holding here is a suction thing that you suction to your kitchen counter 
So you don't it find these with fight. them because most people don't keep them, they throw them away. But this looks great. Everything this looks, needs the motor clean. needs cleaned. If it works, we'll put it on there for $35 or worth. We may part it out because the blade's selling for $9, the table's selling for $15, the, the base is selling for $15. You don't find that on there, and the motor's selling for $35. But I think I'll sell it. I think it should be sold as a complete yeah. slicer. All right, I got Tinker Toys. It's supposed to have 180. We haven't counted them yet, but we'll count them and but put them on will. eBay. Oh, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the thumbs up. Hit the notification bell. And comment. And share us with others. And share us with others. Give me up to 10,000. I want some pink hair. Come on. These are brand new Yahtzee handheld games. I know we have a dollar a piece in them. I'm not sure what they'll list for. And I don't know how many thermos containers we not bought because we can't find this part so this is kind of rare this is a rare part for the uh thermos okay i have a magna bright two quart usa made saucepan that's a nice one a heavy one aluminum very nice and i got an ostomizer 12 speed blender. Osterizer. 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 You didn't pay that for it. I didn't pay that for it. I mean, they said it worked, but. Again, we can sell this. We can sell this and the chopping blade and parts out of here. All right. My son said he wanted one of these. I have one just like it. It'll clean up. So, Zach, look what I found. And we got a set of uh, pans. What are they? Con Recon. Con Recon Switzerland. They're from July of 2007. Not many of these have sold in the U.S. Here, but they're a heavy pan. I think this is the five quart. And this is probably uh, one, quart. one or one and a half quart. I will check that out. So. All right, we're down to the last items. Um, Flip-flops. These are not for sale. These are mine. Those are Speary, like a boat shoe, a deck shoe. Deck shoes. And Speary's are a good good, good brand. brand. They don't look like they've been worn too much. Uh-uh. Then you got a Polydine. Stockpot. About a six quart. My guess is eight. Eight quart. Make a nice soup pot. And she got parts for jello molds. Yeah, I have some at the house and some of them don't look so good. So I thought, why not buy extra parts? So I got a Longenberger basket. It has the liner and the plastic insert. So three pieces. Paid five bucks for it. This, I don't know. We're already make coffee. What's the brand on this? I don't know. This is called chef o by Towncraft, U.S. patent, so my guess is this was made in the USA. Jim had a thing for blenders yesterday. This is an Osterizer. I already showed that. And again, should this not work, we can sell this. Guess what? That'd be it. That's it. And remember subscribe wait a minute we spent four hundred dollars if you made it this far leave a comment below do you think that we're gonna do okay with the money that we spent what do you think we can make profit wise because i know that we'll double but probably do a lot better than that i think we'll triple it see you next time bye, bye, -bye.